where version one was very much influenced by broadcast with the radar and all the loudest figures and stuff like that, we would like much more possibilities for music production. One of them mm -hmm. is uh, something Show people me has away. really uh, have been asking for, a vector scope. You get it right there. Nice. I love and it. And here we go. There's obviously uh, enormous uh, settings that you can do. One of them being actually the color, but also <laughs> crazy. I like that. Uh, but you can also set uh, the persistency and stuff like that. This new version 2.0 actually supports uh, 96K on nope. the on the physical inputs no. also. So. <laughs> so, uh, so uh, I'm sure you. I'm sure you like that. Uh, actually, well, I do because this session is in 96K, and I didn't even think about it no. because I, I, I wasn't sure. So I called the plugin up, and there it is, 96K. There's a new type of meter, and we call it the balance o meter. <laughs> <laughs> it is a small triangle that describes left-right position uh -huh. of your track. And uh, so it's a kind of, it's a left right meter. But the cool thing is, it's also a mid side meter oh. in one. Oh, cool. If you take something that is mono and placed center, Ooh, you I can like see that graphic. So, <laughs> so you can see this is dead center <laughs> yeah. and mono. Once you put on the mix, there it goes back. Yeah. The new offline bound measure actually makes you able to pick your track and do the measurement offline. Super fast. How does it do that? If you bounce your track here, it will go in offline mode and it will do the measurement as you bounce your track. Crazy. So that's, that's awesome. awesome. Yes. And also we have made more scales. So right now we have a true peak meter, but you can actually choose between a number of, uh, of meters here. We've got a Nordic scale here, a BBC type. It goes on and on. There are, there are lots of new, uh, new scales here. Another thing is on this side, mm -hmm. we let it up to you to decide how you want to organize it. Now I'm just going to remove everything here, just for oh, just for the just for the fun. Remove them what? like this, so I only have my two big meter. So that makes it a more clean meter if you want. But it basically lets me decide myself how I want my screen. Right. So, for instance, I would like to have program loudness, I would probably have two peak max to know my, my peaks in the, in the mix. And let's just say the loudness range. Awesome. So that's, uh, some, that's of cool. the new, some of the new features uh, for version 2.0. Thank you for joining us for this small Clarity M session. <laughs> <laughs> You're cool. very welcome, very welcome. <laughs>